Hi all, uh, welcome back to my channel. It's me Danya here. I'm a CPC certified trainer. I'm working as a training team head as well as a placement coordinator for DV Sahastra Tech Solution. Okay, uh, so I'm giving this introduction for those who are asking me like what I'm doing, what is my profession for all those things i'm a cpc certified trainer okay i do candidates i do train candidates uh, for cpc certification as well as if they require general medical coding training as well as interview preparation those things will be guided by me anyways uh, today's topic is uh, modifier 50 so modifier 50 is also a cpt modifier so if you're watching my channel for the first time please do subscribe and if you find it useful, please do share it with your friends. And then if uh, you have already seen my modifiers video, please do check the playlist for uh, the newly added modifiers. And if you are seeing it for the first time also, no worries, please do have a view in the playlist. So I have added a separate playlist for CPT modifiers. So it will be useful for you to understand the different type of modifiers, how it is being used, um, because I have added few examples which will properly guide you uh, how to assign modifiers along with the procedure code. Okay, before uh, this, okay, let's get start. Okay, fine. Today's topic will be modifier 50. Modifier 50 is called as bilateral procedure. Okay, bilateral procedure. So, bilateral procedure, bi means what? Two. Lateral means sides, two sides. Okay, if one procedure is repeated on both the sides on the same day by the same doctor, in that case, you have to assign that procedure code and then add 50 modifier indicating that this procedure is repeated on both the sides. And one more thing, what you have to keep in mind is when you check into the CPT codes, some codes will include both the sites, uh, both the sites. In that case, no need to give 50 modifier and all. If it is a single code representing only one side of the body and if that procedure is repeated on both the sides, in that case, along with that single procedure code, you will be adding 50 modifier to indicate that this procedure is repeated on both the sides and uh, for some insurers they will require uh, instead of 50 they will be requiring uh, LT or RT that is left side and right side so uh, either you should give 50 or else you should separate the code by giving LT and RT okay if uh, that procedure code itself includes both the side then no need to assign 50 modifier this is all about it's very simple if the same procedure is repeated on both the sides you should give that procedure code and you should add 50 modifier along with the procedure code this is all about 50 modifier it's very simple so please do uh, have a view on uh, this full video don't skip it and write the definition and examples whatever added in the ppt so that uh, at the time of interviews it will be helpful for you okay so you can if you make a note of it and keep you at the time of interviews you can go through your notes no need to uh, come and check the video and all okay so please keep and write uh, uh, the notes along with you uh, that's all about 50 modifier and at last if you are looking for cpc certification training or interview preparation or anything you can contact me my mail id is added uh, so please um, uh, please uh, post your queries also and if you need any additional uh, classes or anything you can mail me or you can put it as a comment also thank you thank you for watching my video thank you for your time take care bye bye